and welcome back to my channel, Angela here. So guys, I'm back and as you can see, I am in a different environment. So I had some business to take care of out of town along with a little bit of pleasure. <laughs> but anyway, I'm back with a haul for you guys. And um, like I said, it just does not stop. If I have some items and I'm moving around, I'm going to take them with me so I can bring you guys these hauls. You know, you gotta keep them moving. You gotta keep them rolling. So my package came in from Shein, and normally with Shein, I do not really buy clothing items. I kind of see why now. I mean, not to say they're not cute, but the sizing can be a little funny and a little bit off. I'm, I'm kind of confused. I'm not going to lie. Like some stuff fits, some stuff, it just fits funny, and some stuff is just way off. But, you know, regardless, I wanted to try more than swimwear. Now, I have purchased from Shein before, but it's normally just swimwear. I do think I tried a few regular clothing items in the past, but I did not remember how that worked out for me. So, I went on ahead and gave it a little try just to see, you know, what's what. So, yeah. So, the first set that I got, I'm getting right into the video, is a tie-dye set. And you guys see tie-dye everywhere is trending. I have went completely overboard and summer hasn't even 100% started yet with tie-dye. But this is a skirt. It's a really, really cute, bright skirt. As you can see, it has like red, orange, blue, green, all those pretty colors. But the sizing is kind of off. This is it's supposed to be a size 1X and it's kind of huge. Like I can fit a whole nother one of my meaty ham hot thighs in here if I had one and i would still probably have room left but it's super cute the material is like a cotton blend it's soft it has great give my only complaint would be the sizing this is what the top looks like and it's pretty big too but because my chest is kind of big i'm top heavy you couldn't really tell that this was a little bit bigger and i did not mind it being a little bit bigger but it does have like these little sleeves and the bottom says love. I thought this set was really, really cute and bright and fun. For the summer, I just wish, you know, that it was made to fit a size 1X. As you can see, this looks like possibly a 2, 2, 3X. And if you would like to get this item with a set, I would probably suggest sizing down. So... Uh, this was very inexpensive. I will link everything in the description. I'm not sure about pricing, but I'm pretty sure if I got it and I'm cheap, yeah, I don't think it was more than maybe like $12. It had to be under 12 bucks because I'm not paying more than that, you know, from, <laughs> from Shein. So next up, okay, I'm mixing them up. I guess it doesn't matter the order, but this dress is my favorite item out of the whole haul, which I should have displayed first. But this is like a super cute, so what's the tea? What's the news? I really, really like this. It's a white and black, like newsprint dress. It has these little thin spaghetti straps and they are not adjustable, but that didn't really matter because it still fit me well. It's a size 0XL, so I guess it's just a regular size XL. Now, straight out of the package, I thought that it looked a little bit wide. I'm like, oh, it's going to make me look like a box. It's not going to fit like my curves because it looks pretty wide. But actually, when I put it on, it fit just fine. So, like, it was super cute. I wore this out last night. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to take pictures. So, you know, you'll see the picture in the thumbnail of what it looked like and also with me trying it on. So I'm guessing they really actually printed stuff from actual uh, newspapers, I guess. I don't know, it has all kind of stuff about Korea and translation and all kind of stuff on this dress. But it was super cute. I really liked the fit and it was the perfect lit. So like this was grade A to me. So next up, I'm going to move on to a two-piece set, which was about the worst out of the group out of the whole haul so i don't even know how to hold these shorts that's how big they are so they came like super when i tell you super wrinkled i ran the iron over them and they were still wrinkled but you know that's no biggie if they would have fit so like basically these shorts had a whole kangaroo pouch in the front like i could fit a couple of babies in the front of these shorts 
of course this material does not have any give um, the only thing that kind of has give is the elastic waistband and they are kind of short or whatever but if they would have fit it would have been really nice because i love red and then i love the fact that it has the white stripes on the whole set i was about to say attached but on the set but with the shirt the shirt fit fast so i'm just not understanding it and it's like a halter top for the shirt my top ties fit in there just fine I like the little ruffly under bottom under the boobs. It's like a gathered little ruffle under the boobs. And of course it's cropped. So I thought that was really cute, but I'm kind of peed about these shorts. I really don't know what I can do with this. I was looking forward to kind of wearing this set. I thought that this was like going to be one of my favorite, you know, purchases from Shein. But unfortunately not. So that was one, two, three. Let me move on to my fourth and I'll do the swimwear last. So next up is this top, which I thought was absolutely adorable. So this is a crop top and it has the spaghetti straps, as you can see, and has a little crossed over detail in the front. Uh, you can wear it with the bra, without a bra, it depends on you know how your boobies sit. Um, it looks wide, but it's not as wide as I think, especially once you put your chest inside of it. I like the little boxy detail. I loved the color, and that's kind of what made me want to purchase this. What size is this? I think this is a size, it's a size 1XL. And what I paired this with, oh, the straps are adjustable. And what I paired this with was some regular black shorts that I got from Rainbow on clearance, I wanna say at the end of last summer for like three bucks, like some $20 shorts for three bucks. So that was cute, that was a go. Next up, <laughs> I don't know what the hell she was thinking with this one. Okay, so the concept of the swimsuit was wonderful. Like I love the little watermelon detail and I actually have a fanny pack that would go with this. It does have adjustable straps, but you know, this is a one piece. Tell me what woman who wears a size 1XL or even an extra large is going to fit this and is going to fit correctly. Just look how small it is. Like I can fit this whole swimsuit into the frame of <laughs> the camera. This is ridiculous. Like it gave me everything like it had to smash down everything to get in it i couldn't even lift my boobs for support because it was so small and so tight um so i would suggest if you wear maybe a size large or even a medium this would fit right but it did come with cups on the inside which i did not really like how they sat and I don't see anywhere where you can remove the cups, so you would have to make a slit to cut them out yourself. And basically, my booty ate it, so it became a thong. I didn't really want to show it. I'm not sure if I showed a little bit of it or not, but it's not made to be a thong. It's made to be cheeky, but it was a thong on me because, yeah, it was little as hell. I'm not even going to lie. But that's what I get because I think this was the cheapest thing that I purchased, even cheaper than a tank top. So I think this was like four to six dollars maybe even eight i don't know but i thought it was cute and if it would have fit right it would have been perfect for what i wanted it for so you know a little stereotype watermelon black people don't matter i still like it <laughs> so next and this another item that i'm kind of confused about because it's the same size it's this swim set Okay, no, it's not. This is 2XL, so I did size up with this, maybe because I was scared, but I should have got the 1XL. So it comes with these cheetah print bottoms, and it's like the gray and black cheetah print, not the beige and tan and black cheetah print. So they're really cute, but you see how wide they are. So they were pretty big. They were not really cheeky, but you are going to get a little bit of cheek action with these. And they are high-waisted, but the top is really what made me want to get it. So I saw Daquana with a similar swimsuit, but I think hers came from somewhere else. And it was a different color, but it still kind of inspired me to go ahead and snag this up. And I'm trying to close it. That's why I'm looking down, but 
They don't want to do what I wanted to do. So this is what the top is looking like. And it's pretty big. Like, I don't know if you're supposed to have under boob with it, but I definitely had a little bit of spillage. I kept trying to push the girls back up. I don't know if I should remove the padding because you can see the padding when I tried it on, which I did not like. Now, I love the color, the concept, and the print. So you got like half cheetah, half red, which red is my favorite color for the 150th time. But it does have the straps that come around the front and clasps together. I thought that was super cute. So overall, it's a super cute swimsuit, but I just wish, you know, that it would have fit a little bit better. But that may be my fault because maybe I should have got my regular size. I'm always thinking, though, when you buy swimsuits from like China-based website websites or Asian-based websites, you kind of want to size up because you just never know, especially if you have like booby or booty problems. But that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching my Shein haul. Don't forget to let me know what you thought about this video. What was your favorite? Uh, if you're not subscribed and you want to see all these goodies, you might as well go ahead and click that button. I'm friendly. I am so friendly. <laughs> but I love you guys and I thank you guys for all the support. Don't forget to share my videos. Check me out on Instagram. And until my next video, which might be a few days from now, you might see the same week and possibly the same dress because I think I'm going to record another one. But I will check you guys out later. Much love. Bye.